hello viewers welcome back to another video so today in this video i'm going to show you how to solve this site can't be reached error on subdomain i'm going to show you how you can point your subdomain to your main domain so you don't get this error so before i start fixing this problem i will open a new tab and type the address and uh, as you can see I'm getting this error here on my subdomain. If I go back to my cPanel and go to subdomains, you can see that uh, this is the new domain I created. And uh, even in the Softaculous installer, I'm not able to open this website. So let me open the WordPress manager. If I click on the login, I'm still getting this same error. But if I go to my main domain, you can see it is active. So how to fix this? I'm going to show you just that in this video. Now to fix this error, you have to access to your DNS settings, which you will get in your web hosting account. I'm sure if you have a website and a web hosting, just open your web hosting. Since I'm using the Cloudflare as my DNS, I will log into my Cloudflare account. So the settings are all same. You just have to do the same settings in your web hosting account. So open your web hosting or Cloudflare if you are using Cloudflare. Let me log into the Cloudflare and select my website and here you have so many settings go to DNS please uh, use your judgment here I'm doing this in Cloudflare because I'm using Cloudflare for my website if you are using your default name servers then you have to do it in your web hosting account so open the DNS settings and here you will find all the DNS uh, records just uh, copy this IP address which is my IP address you have to copy yours and then you have to add a new record a new a record just select the type as a and in the name you have to enter the subdomain name in our case it is shop.tipswithalam.com just paste this ip here and uh, click on save now this is gonna take some time to update the dns a few moments later now if I go back to my subdomain and click on reload you can see my subdomain is up and running and uh, you can access your WordPress dashboard from here. It is very simple you just have to open your DNS settings either in your Cloudflare or in your web hosting account and add a new A record pointing to your IP address of your main domain. And if you want more videos on cPanel, WordPress and online marketing, you can go explore my channel. I have plenty of videos on those topics. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to give a like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.